Hi guys, welcome back and I'm Sadhvi and I hope you all are doing really well. So in today's video, I'm going to do a Deepika Padukone inspired makeup and hairstyle. I'm going to do this classic smoky eye with nude lips. So this is like a three step eyeshadow and it's really simple to do it. So keep watching the video till the end to see how I did this hair and makeup. Let's dive right into the video. Okay, so now getting started with the makeup look. I'm going to do my eyes first as we are going for a smoky eye. So there are going to be some fallouts and it becomes quite difficult to clean them up later. And you see her makeup look, you'll notice that there are no shimmers used on the lids. So I'm definitely going with all the matte shades. To create this smoky eye, I'm using this eyeshadow palette from MAC. And you can use any palette here that is grey and black shades because you won't need a lot of colors to create this look. First, I'm going to apply some concealer on my lids. I'm just going to blend this all over my eyes. I'm just going to use some loose powder to set my concealer. this dark grayish color to define my crease and the outer V and I'm using this eyeshadow blending brush. I've just taken a little bit of product on my brush and I'm going to apply it in my crease and I'm going to just blend it out. You can see that I'm just taking this inwards. Like want your eye makeup to look perfect the key is to just keep blending it now that I've defined my crease and my outer V I have to just deepen my crease a little bit and to do that I'm using this black shade right here you can use any any black shade over here now I'm going to apply this gray shade all over my lid to use the same black shade that I used to deepen my crease on my lower lash line. I'm going to use this Maybelline Colossal Kajal on my waterline. I'm using this gel eyeliner from Body Shop and I'm going to take this on my angular brush and apply it on my upper lash line and I'm going to smudge this. I'm just going to smudge this a little bit. Whenever you're doing a smoky eye, make sure you do the eyes first because I don't know whether you can see it or not but there's a lot of fallout and it becomes really difficult to clean it, clean this up later. I'm going to highlight the inner corner of my eyes. So before moving on to mascara, I'm going to do my brows first and I'm using this Wet n Wild Eyebrow Kit. I'm going to start from the bottom of my brows and I'll start filling in all the sparse areas. I'm going to highlight my brow bones. So 
सो वेन यू नोटिस हर मेकअप लुक यू नोटिस डैट हर आई लैशेज लुक सो नैचुरल बट एट द सेम टाइम दे लुक सो वॉल्यूमिनस सो फर्स्ट आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट विद दिस आई लैश कलर आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू होल्ड माई लैशेज एंड नाउ मेरे फ्रेस इट एंड मूव इट जस्ट लाइक दिस अप एंड डाउन फॉर लाइक फाइव टू सेवन सेकेंड्स The same way I'm gonna do for this one. Just hold it, press it, move a little bit like up and down. For my mascara, I'm using this Maybelline Hyper Curl mascara. I'm going to apply it on my lower lashes as well. almost done with the eyes just some fine touches at the end moving on to my base first i'm going to moisturize and i'm going to use lots of moisturizer to get that glowy and dewy base and i'll be using my nivea light moisturizer using this nika prep me up primer this kind of blurs out my pores and gives a really flawless base a little bit around my chin you were on this area moving on to concealer i really like to mix my uh, la girl pro conceal and fit me concealer i'm going to apply it underneath my eyes on my t zone and a little bit around my mouth area First I'm going to apply my pro conceal. I'm going to apply this uh, Fit Me concealer. Just going to spray a little bit of setting spray on my sponge. Just going to blend it all out. foundation i'm using my all time favorite fit me foundation in the shade 128 warm nude and just going to take one pump of this that's it i'm just going to dab this sponge using my nick setting spray Now we're done with the base, and you can see how glowy this looks. Now I'm slightly going to contour my face, and I'm using this contour powder from Sugar Cosmetics. I'm going to apply this a little bit on my cheekbones. I'm going to drag it towards my jawline. Now I'm just going to blend this. I'm going to contour my nose. Now moving on to blush. Again, I'm using this one from Sugar Cosmetics. This one is in the shade zero one Peach Peak. For my highlighter again I'm using this one from Maybelline this one is master chrome highlighter in the shade molten gold 100 this is my all time favorite
for my lipstick, I'm using this Huda Beauty Liquid Matte. This is in the shade Bombshell. So now I'm going to create the same hairstyle that she did in the picture. So you can see that I slightly straighten my hair. I'm going to roughly section my hair from the arc of my brows, just like this. So I'm just going to take a small part right here. And I'm going to slightly back comb it. So now from the corner of my eyebrows, I'm going to roughly section my hair again and I'm going to take a larger part of it now. I'm just going to comb them. Now I'm just going to fix this with my bobby pins. So this is the final look after the hairdo and makeup and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you like it give it a big thumbs up and let me know in the comments below if you want me to recreate more celebrity inspired makeup looks and most importantly don't forget to subscribe.